Hi everyone, welcome back to Everyday Living with Keishia, and today is another haul video. I'm really excited. This is my third one, and today's stuff's going to come from various places. Um, of course, some of them are Christmas gifts because the holidays are here finally, and I'm really excited. So let's just get right into it. Okay, so for the first item, well, the first items, I purchased from Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree happens to be one of my favorite stores, and it actually has a lot of name brand makeup. I know some people are like, really? Typically when I go in there, I see like LA Colors or NYC or something I have never even heard of before. But actually they do have makeup by different people such as Eyes, Lips, and Face. I've seen Maybelline. I've seen All May. I've seen some cover girl in there. It just really depends when you catch like the actual drugstore makeup within Dollar Tree. And I think um, the reason why they even have drugstore makeup in Dollar Tree is because maybe there's like something um, wrong with the, with the package. I know it's like with some of my, some of the eyeshadows and the lip glosses that I recently purchased, you know, maybe the plastic is actually coming off of, you know, running alongside the cardboard or extends out further than the cardboard. And usually with anything, um, if a machine, if something messes up when the machine is creating it, it usually does go to a store such as like Dollar Tree or Big Lots or what's another store? Uh, sometimes Dollar General. But anywho, let's actually get into the stuff now. So the first couple of items I have are by Maybelline. I'm a huge Maybelline fan. I think they are fantastic especially for a woman uh, a lady of color i'm number three coco in their foundation um they're actually the first foundation i've ever worn and i fell in love with them so i bought a few items i actually ran into dollar tree it was my it's a friend of mine her best friend's birthday just passed and so i went in there and i said well let me go in here i know they probably have something good in the cosmetic section and they did. So the first couple of items I have shadow effects. And this color is supposed to be limited edition. Um, and this is an eyeshadow and an eyeliner. And this color is neutral. So it's kind of greenish, grayish, if that makes sense. And I actually got four of these. I got it in Neutral, fresh, pretty, and amber. And amber and pretty are very nice, like, shades of pink. And these are all for a dollar. And here is the fresh, oh, such a nice forest green. I can definitely see me rocking this as an eyeliner, you know, on the waterline. I also got um, glossy lip color shine seduction and i've actually had this before in a different and this is new but i've actually had this before in like a shimmer pink loved it loved it loved it loved it and actually i think i got that one at kroger for seven dollars this was a dollar at dollar tree such as everything else i showed you and i also have another eyeliner i think this is a like a plum color and you, you see what I mean like if you go to like like some of the plastics running off the edge of the the package but if you go to like Walmart or something of that nature this will actually be straight up and down you know it's not packaged diagonal that's what I mean by these are like defected items like they they weren't they didn't I guess something happened in the in the factory but if you go to like Walmart or something, this isn't diagonal. This is actually like straight up and down. So that's what I mean by I think, you know, the people who uh, actually package this makeup, they're probably like, you know, we made a mistake. Let's ship it to somewhere like Dollar Tree. So all of those items were a dollar. And when I went to like Walmart, the lip gloss is like $7. So I had like a 99.9% .9 savings. Another item I got from Dollar Tree is NYC lip gloss. Another perfect example, I was I looked in Walmart, and that's what I do. I purchase at Dollar Tree, and then I go to Walmart or the nearest store like um, Target or something. And this too, this is not packaged diagonal at Walmart. It's actually up and down. So that's what I mean by 
you know, there's nothing wrong with actual lip gloss. It's just the way that it's packaged. I mean, this is this is running off the box a lot. I don't know if you can see, but yeah, it's running off the box a lot. So same packaging, just box. And that's it. A surplus of these, about five. So I'm gonna show you three. Is the Alme mascara, and I love this stuff. Um. Like I said, I went into Dollar Tree recently for my girlfriend, Ashana, and she was like, you know, this is a new mascara. And I was like, well, you should buy this. And she was like, is that any good? And I actually have I have it on my eyes today. And I also had it on my eyes that they were in Dollar Tree. And I said, yeah, look at my eyes. And she was like, oh, that's really nice. And then she bought one. And I was like, trust me, you don't want to get more than one. But, you know, she just got one that day. And then yesterday she went to the Wale concert. And she wore this mascara and her eyelashes look so bomb. I mean, it looked like she had false ones on because they were so extended. Like this is the the dial up. You can dial up to three coats. Love it, love it, love it. And Dollar Tree has this for a dollar. It's, I believe, six and some change at Walmart. So you should definitely check out your local Dollar Tree. And I don't know what's wrong with this packaging because they all seem fine to me. Like they're all packaged the same way. Um... But at Dollar Tree, these are dollar, and at like your local Walmart Target, they run for six or seven dollars. Another item I got was by L'Oreal. They sell L'Oreal as well, but once again, the packaging is like really bad. And this is eyeshadow stick. Um, and this is in Cherry Ice. And when I what I do is I go into Dollar Tree and I buy at least one of each item that i like oh i may like this because dollar tree they don't give refunds they only do exchanges so i'll get one and i'll bring it back home and i'll try to find an outfit i could wear it with immediately so if i like it i can always go back and buy five or at least i if i really like it i'll buy at least five to ten extras because there's a great chance that you may never see this product again in dollar tree for a dollar like whose machine makes that many mistakes so another great steal that I got recently at Dollar Tree was Eyes, Lips, and Face. And they had two shadows that were there, um, Saddle and Pebble. I like Saddle as like a, like a crease color because it doesn't really show up that well. It's not really pigmented for my skin complexion. And I haven't tried Pebble yet. But these are a dollar as well in Dollar Tree. And what was funny about it, I saw these a week beforehand in Big Lots. And in Big Lots, they had them for $2.50. And then when I went with Hashana and I sent it for a dollar, I said, hmm, somebody's going to be getting returned tomorrow. So I actually returned the $5 for both from Big Lots. I returned those today. And I had bought these two. And, um... Since I, I like this as a crease color, I'm not going to buy any more. I like, I'm just going to keep this one. And then, so this is, it's a, it's pretty small. If you have the blushes by them, it's a tad bit smaller than the actual blush. I don't have my blush up here anywhere, but. And here's the actual color. It's a really nice brown. For me, it's good for a crease color. And it, and it says you can wet it or not. Um, another great thing, um, I'm really upset that I only got five of them, but if you have, if you own the Berry Mary by Eyes, Lips, and Face, which is a blush, it shows it really fantastic for my skin complexion. It's like a dark pink, and they also had, once upon a time, they had those at Dollar Tree, too, over the summer. And as you know, their studio line, most of their items are $3 each, um, and this was a dollar at Dollar Tree, and over the summer, I got five of the Berry Mary, because I bought one, I fell in love with it, because I was trying to find a blush that I could use and it was cheap because I used to wear Mary Kay. It was like a Mary, Mary Kay has one called, it's not Berry, Berry Mary. It's something similar like that, but um, it was $10 and I was like, you gotta be kidding me. So when I, I tried every blush Elf had to offer and then I finally ran into the Berry Mary and that is now my favorite blush and the only blush that I use and I got it five uh, cases of it. Um, excuse me, five packs of it from Dollar Tree for a dollar over the summer. And when I went back, because I really wanted to get the entire rack, they were gone. So I'm really mad that I only got five of them. So last but not least, um, some other eyeshadows that I got by Elf. I got the Lux and the Ivy Four Quads. 
I got these also for Dollar Tree for a dollar, and I got about five of each. Like I said, I always buy one, and then if I really like it, I'll go back to Dollar Tree either the same day or the next day, because women know when there's some good stuff in there, and they will get all of it. So I try to use it immediately so I can go back and buy a surplus of it, and you guys should definitely go to your Dollar Tree, see what they have, because they have elf brushes and lip gloss. Yes. So definitely check your local Dollar Tree out to see if they have some cosmetics that you like. And as you've seen, they have Maybelline, they have Elf, they have L'Oreal, they have Alme. Like I said, sometimes they'll even have um, some Sally Henson. What else do they have in there? I'm trying to look at my makeup thing. And other makeup brands I typically don't wear. And they even have some of mine in there. So definitely check your local Dollar Tree out to see if they have some cosmetic items that you like so that's pretty much it until next time next time i'll have another haul of gorgeous fabulous items that you can go out and buy at your local store for a special loved one or a friend and i will see you next time thank you for watching everyday living with kaisha